Hello, Internet friends. Let's talk about the law-abiding citizen. The law-abiding citizen is somebody who pretty much rolls over and plays dead. They don't stand for anything. They don't stand up to anything. The only thing they want to do is lay low, follow the rules, and stay out of trouble. Well, I can appreciate that, but only to a certain point. You know, we have so many amoral and unconstitutional laws in the book that restrict our liberties. I am actually in awe that we have gone so many years with so many of our rights stripped away from us. Let's take, for example, the 1965 Hart Seller Act. I am absolutely in awe that people stood for that. I know there was a lot of people who protested it, but nobody did anything. I mean, there should have, that was absolute treason. People should have been executed for passing that. And then the people who are in our uh, government right now, those are people who are not progeny Americans. What the heck? Those people need to be swinging from a tree. This is ridiculous. This has just gotten absolutely so far out of hand because good people didn't want to do anything. And that's pretty much what a law-abiding citizen is. It's a good person who just doesn't want to act. And I can appreciate that in the short term, they don't want to have a lot of trouble and lose their things because a lot of law-abiding, well, I wouldn't say a lot, but half the law-abiding citizens in this country are paying all the taxes and they're the people with the assets. And if they stand up to tyranny, then they risk losing those assets and fighting against the government. Because, you know, if you fight against the government, you can't win. But then there is that long game where if you don't do anything, you're going to lose all your shit anyway. All right, Internet friends, thank you so much for listening. And I look forward to your thoughts below.